Hello and welcome back to my channel or if you're new here nice to meet you my name is Reya and today I'm just doing you a beauty pay haul video without makeup anything I just got my parcel from post and I opened it to see that everything is intact so let's start I'm going to put all the um, things in the screen and the prices like I've used to because I didn't have any paper here that test says that it, what I have in here so I actually don't have now the prices I can't tell you them right away but I have this huge box in front of me so let's begin um, I ordered Milani fruit fetish blueberry acai uh, lip balm looks like this it smells like blueberries or yeah or maybe black currant actually a very nice smell I tried it it feels nice on the lips and yeah I just wanted to try something because there's been like a there's a lot of um, going on of different tastes lip no I mean smells deep <laughs> different smells of um, um, lip balms and I didn't want to buy the uh, those uh, is it Too Faced? those hangover lip balms or what are they so I ordered this one instead and then I ordered the six colors set of the Disney color sticks from that Beauty Bay had because I've heard that these are very nice on the um, waterline so I ordered the whole set so this one has yellow dark purple this kind of pinkish peachy shade then a lavender and blue and orange and these are all in fact I can show you one that what it looks like like because these are not eyeliners these are eyeshadow sticks color sticks but it's this kind of rectangular and then it's it has it's like not a sharp end but you can use this on the waterline and I know uh, many people that I know use this as a waterline uh, colors but if you want to, I can try to use them as a shadow sticks too. If you want to see that. Uh, then I ordered uh, the Beauty Bay Eye Base. Finally, I uh, wanted to try it. So I ordered mine in the shade 2, I think. Base 3. Um, these are, uh, this is actually surprisingly big. Because like... Well, I guess it's the same size as the P. Lewis, but it just feels bigger. Okay, this might be... Well, I don't know. I wanted more like a, my skin color, not lighter. Like my P. Lewis is lighter, my ABH is lighter, so I wanted something that is really like my skin color. So that's that. Then I had to get the uh, Chroma Cole Chrome Collection Liquid Crystal Eyeshadow Trio. Uh, was this at the? It was in one of their collection. Was it the dark collection that these came out? I didn't want the palette, but I wanted these because, like, look at this. Oh my god, I can't wait to test this. I haven't swatched them yet and I won't. Or should I? Maybe a little bit. So there is this green purple one. Mm. I can't see without my glasses. I know the ring light will shine from my glasses, but what's the... 
I'm not sure what, what's the shade name of this, but it's the greeny purple one. This is like a purple and then it has a silver. Wow. I bet you can't see the shifts in, in the camera and I'm sorry about that, but like especially that middle shade is stunning. And this green one also, when you look it at the you could see that crunchy green there now. But it has also like an now you can see that. And I can see it like tealy blue in it. And wow, those feel amazing. No, oh, I'm such a mess, but I need my makeup wipes. Oh. I, I need to wipe this off before it's everywhere. Those are pretty, like the silver, it's, it's silver, you know, but if I remember right, you can't buy them um, alone, so you have to buy the trio if you are going to buy. Um, then I ordered two uh, four pack lip liners. I ordered the nude collection and the berry collection because I needed like really nude lip liners. So there's the four different shades in each one. Here's the nude ones. And I can put them here. And then the berry ones because I have so many shades of that uh, Maybelline Superstay Matte Ink in different shades of berries. So, here's the berry shades. Yeah, it's nice that there is like a dark too. It's not just very light shades. So that was that. Then I got a <sighs> buyer's gift. The Jeffree Star Mini Orchid Palette, which I'm not going to use ever. And I'm most likely going to sell it. We'll see. It kind of feels bad for me to sell something that I have gotten as a free gift. But I know there's a lot of people who really enjoy the formula of Jeffree Star, but they don't want to buy straight from Jeffree. So I can sell that to someone. And it's nude shimmers, which I don't need. I just got the Gloss Gods nude palette that has amazing shimmers. Then I accidentally I ordered two of the face palettes, the first light face palettes. I'm going to give other one to Tia as a Christmas present. She knows it already that I'm giving it to her, so don't worry about me telling it now. But this is the face palette, so it has a bronzer, two blushes and a an highlighter. And this highlighter calls to my name. I don't know if you can see. Let me swatch it better. Like this isn't the same as you. If you remember, I have the four shade. Look at that highlighter! Wow. I have the four shade um, highlighter palette from Beauty Bay, um, but they are putty like. This isn't putty like. So. And Misa really liked it, so I thought, what the heck, I can buy it because I bought so much other stuff to this. But these aren't, aren't expensive stuff. Like, yes, the order was expensive, but uh, individually they are not expensive. And here's the other face palette that I'm going to put aside for Tia. And then I have the eyeshadow palettes left. First one, I have the Nude 42 color palette. I just wanted some basic uh, nudes for my collection uh, in this Beauty Pay formula because the Beauty Pay formula is so good. And this is the palette. And I really like that it has the grays and cool tones. 
it has like two shimmer roads in here, these two, and then these one rows and this row are mats, and then this lower row has few mats and few shimmers. But yeah, this looks like like I don't think these are uh, really special shimmers uh, by the looks of them, like the ones in in that gloss god palette. But mostly I'm drawn to the mats of this anyway. But I really like that there's very dark shimmers, so you can do a really, really nice smoky eye with them. I'm running out of space in here. I'm running out of space. And then, uh, so this was like a 242 color uh, eyeshadow palette pack, like a bundle. Uh, so actually, don't throw those away. Then the other one is Fiery uh, 2.0. Because I like, look at this. I can't wait to try these yellow, yellowy, greenish shades. And the oranges and the reds. And oh, it has neutral shades too, of course. But you know, I'm so happy that I've got this. Like, I've been eyeing this for quite a long time already, so now I got it. And then the last thing was another 42 pen palette. This is the Bright 2.0. And first when I saw this, I wasn't like keen to it, but then... Missa has made video with it and... And the Beauty Bay formula is amazing, so I, I went and bought it. And actually now that I'm looking at it, when I watched it in the pictures, it looked like a chaos to me. But now then I look at it as person, you can clearly see there's a, like a yellow-orange row. Then there's this neutralish row, greenish, yellowish row, bluish, purple and pink. So it's not that chaotic. The difference is that the shades are not in the darkness order, what makes it look like more uh, chaotic than it is. So if this would have been laid like the bright mats, it look, would look very different. But this is probably the most exciting thing for me uh, alongside with those uh, multi-chrome multi eyeshadows. Yeah. So that's the uh, Bright 2.0 palette. And that's the haul today. Like, not a long video. And for Friday, um, I wasn't able, I can't, I'm not able to film the Is It Too Old for Friday video uh, this week. Uh, so I figured I'd do this whole video and fill, um, put that on Friday. And, um, let me know what you want to see me use first and what are you interested in anyway to see. Do you want me to do videos with testing all these palettes? Uh, and would you like it to be dedicated videos for the palettes or maybe like a get ready with me where I'm using the palette? Like dedicated, I mean that I do three looks at least with the palettes. So. Please let me know and if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up, subscribe if you haven't already and hit the notification bell so YouTube notifies you of every new upload and we will see you hopefully very soon. Bye!